Christian Tapia versus Thomas Matisse. To those who don't know, they recently fought over in Cleveland, Ohio, in the undercard of the Love versus Spark event, uh, which was shown live on the Zone. You can go to the Zone right now and watch the whole entire event over there on replay. And uh, yeah, this fight was scheduled for ten rounds. It ended up going the whole ten rounds, and Thomas Matisse pulled off the big win. I think it was a big win because he was going in there against an undefeated Christian Tapia and he was able to pull it off. Tapia started off strong from the get-go from the first round. He was super aggressive, got caught in the second, got dropped. And after that, it was, you know, Matisse landing some good clean punches in the third. I think he nearly dropped him again. And, uh, you know, I thought Matisse was about to get the knockout win or TKO win. But then uh, Christian Tapia ended up um, rebounding, getting his composure and, uh, you know, having moments, good moments and made the fight close in my opinion. I thought he, in the middle rounds, he was able to rebound and bounce back. Uh, and, and he actually, he rocked Matisse a couple times. But in the closing seconds, I mean, the closing couple rounds, I thought, uh, uh, whew, I'm watching the Love Spark fight right now. Love just got dropped. Holy cow. Oh my goodness. But anyway, um, yeah, it was, uh, it was a, a, a very entertaining fight, a lot of back and forth action and props to Matisse for taking those punches because he got caught clean a couple times where it looked like he might go down, but he showed a lot of heart and determination and eventually led, uh, you know, survive and went to uh, the scorecards and won this fight. Uh, by unanimous decision with all three judges having in his favor 96 93 96 93 97 92 all in favor of thomas matisse and with this win uh he improves to 20 and 3 one draw 15 wins coming by way of knockout tico that's three wins in a row now since lo losing to luis melendez with this win winning the wbc continental america super featherweight belt i'm sure it will lead to bigger and better fights at least i hope it will and um and yeah, it's a very good win for Matisse to win in front of his hometown fans over in Cleveland, Ohio. As for Christian Tapia, uh, first loss in his pro career at the age of 28 years old. It's a learning experience. He had very good moments in this fight. I think, uh, what's his name? Chris Mannix, who is the unofficial scorer for the zone, had it a draw. I think it was it was that close of a fight. But if you take into the consideration the knockdown, I feel like um, the knockdown would be the main difference in the fight, in my opinion. So, anyway, um, good win for Thomas Matisse. Congrats to him again on the win. And, uh, and yeah, if you did see the fight, let me know what did you think about in the comments. This this love spark fight is hitting up, you guys, man. Um, but, yeah, if you saw the fight, let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for listening and watching. And, like always, have a great day. All right, thanks.